So basically, I get on the plane, you know what I'm saying? Off the rip, it's a beautiful thing. Never experienced it. You know what I'm saying? Okay, let's see what it's sitting for. We sit there for about an hour, then we gotta get off the plane. You know what I'm saying? We gotta get off the plane because of the weather and we've been sitting so long that now they gotta put some more food in the plane. Not too bad though. So basically it's like an hour and a half, two hour delay. We get back on the plane and we drive from Raleigh to Newark, New Jersey. Not a bad experience, you know what I mean? I pulled my camera out and everything. Beautiful stewardess on the plane, you know what I'm saying? She was, you could tell she's beautiful just by looking at her eyes. You ain't even gotta see her face. Very nice, very helpful. Everybody on the plane helpful. I'm realizing that this is, this is all right. I'm sitting kind of close to the window. It's not that much room, you know what I'm saying? I guess people could appreciate first class seats. Who got first class seats? I realize that. However, I got my camera out, you know what I mean? Doing, acting like a tourist. Doing my first experience flyer type thingy. And I'm like, okay, this is cool. You know what I'm saying? This saved me a little bit of time than driving. But, uh, you know, the, 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 the reason that you gotta be there, the fact that you gotta be there like two hours ahead of your departure, you know, that kind of like, like, well, you know. Well, at least I didn't have to drive, you know what I'm saying? It did have some benefits to it. I'll tell you one thing, we got from uh, Newark, New Jersey. Pardon me, we got from Raleigh, North Carolina, to Newark, New Jersey in like an hour and 10 minutes. I thought that was amazing. This plane was flying super duper fast. It was that moment that I said in my mind, you know, it won't be my last time flying. It's my first time, but it won't be my last time. I also said, Lord, Please make sure that this ain't my last time, Lord. Please cover us with your protection and your blessings. And he did that. If there's anything we can do to make your flight any more enjoyable, Now, I'm going to be totally to honest with you now. He'll sit back, relax, when I got home, when it was time for me to go home, it started getting a little different. You know what I mean? I'm like, Dad, it's beautiful flight here. Everything beautiful. Now it's time for me to go home. Everything start changing up. And uh, my daughter said, Dad, don't let that be your, you know, outtake on flying planes. I need you to continue because it's not always like this. That's what she said. But for one thing, they canceled my flight without even telling me. This is the flight going back home. Now, mind you, I got a flight where there's no stops. No stops. Straight from Newark to Raleigh, North Carolina. That was my ticket. They canceled the whole flight, gave me a whole nother flight the next day. I said, wow. So I'm online on the website looking for another flight that I can swap out with. They delayed my flight like five times in the airport. Five times in the airport I got delayed. I didn't think I was going to make it home. Then they canceled my flight and made it another day. But I must say, this is the reason it was all worth the hassle. Right, little TJ? Right, little buddy? I'm gonna be all right, little TJ. Little TJ, I'm gonna be all right, my little buddy. I'm trying to tell you, it was such a blessing, such a joyful moment to be rocking my grandson to sleep and spending time with my grandson. It just reminded me all over again of what I had to go through when my kids were babies. And life is so precious. And through all the hassle of the flying, and I missed a day of work because my they kept rescheduling and canceling my flight and I had to get on a freaking waiting list to see if some other seats were available in a different flight. I thought I would never make it home. And I finally made it home about two o'clock in the morning. You know, it was, it was, it was, it, it was, ter it started out nice and it started feeling like it's terrible and I'm never going to fly again. I didn't care, but I tried again. 
But this right here was the reason for the season, I'm trying to tell you. Look at this boy. This is the reason why it was worth it. I just need someone to hold him for a while. And him gonna be alright. Him gonna be alright. We appreciate the view because we do this for you. The conscious is still a way of life. Hit that like button. Subscribe to the channel. Tell a friend to tell a friend about the content, the good, positive content that you've been watching from time to time on your YouTube channel. Tell them. Tell them that it's positive and it sets a good vibe, puts you in a good mood. Tell them we're putting babies to sleep on Conscious Bully Network channel. Hit that like button.